Welcome back. Starting with the alternate lunge. First things first, your sauce is at shoulder width apart, your chest is up and your shoulders are back. This ensures perfect posture. What you're going to do is you're going to take a nice and long leap forward with the leading leg. You're going to drop to 90 degrees at both knees and the hips, okay? Your real knee isn't going to touch the floor and you're going to drive the force through the front heel. Back to starting position in one motion. You don't want to, you don't want to pause on your way up, just all the way back in one motion, okay? And when you return to the starting position, you soul in that shoulder with starts. Now the reason is, is why you drive the weight through the heels of the front foot is because it prevents you from going forward excessively onto the toes, okay? And then you're raising the heels and you're hitting more quads in comparison to the glutes, okay? You want to hit everything nice and evenly. And that's it. Stay to watch the rest of the video to learn more about lunges and see the other variations. Good luck. Lunges are a compound exercise, meaning it works multiple joints and therefore training several muscle groups at once. When a joint changes angle, the tendons crossing these joints are therefore stimulated. So if you have a look, when I extend my elbow joint, it's stimulating now my tricep muscles. Okay? Now in this case, the glutes and the quadriceps are stimulated. And while all the remaining leg musculature, like the hamstrings and calves, are acting as stabilizers throughout the movement. Let's introduce the walking lunges next, and I'm going to add dumbbells to intensify this variation. Now with the walking variation, you don't want to stop in between the reps. You want to keep it nice and flowing right throughout the movement. Don't pause in the middle. Just press right through. Keep your chest up. Don't lean forward. Side lunges is a great variation for improving your mobility. You want to drop right down as far as you can to get full range of motion and that gets the most out of this movement. You're also hitting much more muscle the further you get down. What you want to do is you want to keep your toes at about 45 degrees out and then keep your knees out so it tracks in line with the toes. You don't want the knees to cave in, okay? You don't want the feet to point forward. Point them out about 45 degrees. Improving your range of motion on this exercise will also help improve other exercises such as squats for example and the more range of motion you're able to get in squats the more muscle you're going to hit and the better results you will reap keep the chest up with this exercise and drop the hips a big mistake that people make is that they keep their hips up you want to drop the hips nice and low okay that hits much more glutes you may also do this exercise with just your body weight or also with a barbell on your back and I'll show you the bodyweight variation right now. Bring the hands up, bring the hands down on the way up, hands up on the way down, just like so. There, there. You can step in, or you can also step out, but I prefer the just side to side variation. Four overhead lunges. First, put the bar on your head, okay? And you're gonna set your elbows at about 90 degrees. Depending on your mobility, if your mobility, mobility is really bad, you can sit a bit wider. You're then going to shove the bar right up into lock, into full extension at the elbow joint. You're going to face the armpits forward, okay? You're going to position the bar directly over the shoulder blades, yeah? I don't recommend this exercise for beginners, but I'm going to demonstrate it anyways. Take a nice big step forward again, and at all times, keep the elbows in full extension. Otherwise, the bar is going to put you off balance. Finishing up. There are other variations I did not demonstrate in this video, like for example, diagonal lunges, okay, backwards lunges, backwards diagonal lunges, but the truth is you really don't need to know this shit, okay, people just do it because they're bored, 